Toyota has been working on developing a hydrogen-powered engine for years. The company believes that hydrogen is the future of clean and sustainable mobility, and that hydrogen engines can offer the fun of driving, including through sounds and vibrations, while emitting zero CO2. Now, Toyota has reached a very advanced stage in this pursuit. The company has just revealed its new hydrogen-powered engine and a concept vehicle that could be production-ready soon. Toyota claims that this engine can deliver high performance and responsiveness, as well as reduce the cost and complexity of fuel cell systems. Join us as we take a look at Toyota's new V8 hydrogen engine that will change everything. Everyone knows that Toyota has its reservations in regards to an all-electric future. As the Wall Street Journal reports, former CEO and current chairman Akio Toyota said, people involved in the auto industry are largely a silent majority. That silent majority is wondering whether EVs are really okay to have as a single option, but they think it's the trend, so they can't speak out loudly because the right answer is still unclear. We shouldn't limit ourselves to just one option. While this perspective is very controversial, it's worth thinking about. All electric cars make up only a small part of the overall new car market, which means there's room for different types of vehicles. Toyota has decided to pursue the path of hydrogen combustion engines. Toyota has now introduced the Corolla Cross 8H2 concept, and it is likely to come to market in the next few years. The Corolla Cross H2 concept is a compact crossover that uses a modified version of the 1.6L turbocharged three-cylinder engine that powers the high-performance GR Corolla and GR Yaris models. However, instead of running on gasoline, the engine has been adapted to burn hydrogen as a fuel, which produces only water as a byproduct. This makes the Corolla Cross H2 concept a zero-emission vehicle that can offer the same driving experience and performance as a conventional internal combustion engine car. To achieve this feat, Toyota has applied some of the hydrogen technology that it developed for its FCEV fuel cell electric vehicle, the Mirai, which uses a fuel cell to convert hydrogen into electricity. The Corolla Cross H2 concept features thick armored fuel tanks that can store hydrogen at high pressure and safely withstand impacts and collisions. The engine also has some modifications to handle the different properties of hydrogen gas, such as hardened valves and valve seats, stronger connecting rods, and specially designed fuel injectors that can spray hydrogen into the cylinders. The Corolla Cross H2 concept is not only an eco-friendly vehicle, but also a practical and spacious one. Like a standard Corolla, it has room for five passengers and their luggage and offers a comfortable and smooth ride. Also, in exciting news to gearheads everywhere, Toyota and Yamaha Motor have joined forces to develop a groundbreaking hydrogen-powered V8 engine that could revolutionize the automotive industry. The engine is based on the 5L V8 that powers the Lexus RC Coupe, a luxury sports car that offers a smooth and exhilarating ride. However, the new hydrogen V8 has some significant modifications that make it more eco-friendly and efficient, while still delivering a high level of performance. The engine uses hydrogen as a fuel, which is stored in pressurized tanks and injected into the cylinders where it is ignited by spark plugs. The combustion of hydrogen produces only water vapor as a byproduct, making the engine a zero-emission vehicle that does not contribute to air pollution or global warming. The engine also has some changes to the cylinder heads and fuel injectors, which are designed to handle the different properties of hydrogen gas, such as its higher octane rating and lower density. The hydrogen V8 boasts an impressive output of 450 horsepower at 6,800 revolutions per minute and 398 LBFT of torque at 3,600 revolutions per minute, which is slightly lower than the original gasoline V8, but still enough to provide a thrilling driving experience. The engine also has a unique feature that sets it apart from other engines, an 8 into 1 top-mounted exhaust manifold, which collects the exhaust gases from all eight cylinders and directs them to a single outlet. 
This design creates a distinctive high-frequency sound that Yama claims is similar to the sound of a Formula One car. So what exactly makes hydrogen engines so special? One of the advantages of hydrogen-powered cars is that they are very easy to refuel and they do not require a lot of time to do so. This is because hydrogen is a gas, not a liquid, and it can be pumped into the car's tank much faster than liquid fuels. If you have ever filled a propane tank for your barbecue or camping stove, you know how quickly the process can be done. You just need to connect the nozzle to the tank, open the valve, and wait for a few seconds until the tank is full. The same principle applies to hydrogen-powered cars, but with even more speed and convenience. The new Toyota Yaris GRH2, which is a compact hatchback that runs on hydrogen only, takes a minute and a half to fill its tank completely with hydrogen. That means you can spend less time at the gas station, which would take much longer depending on the size of the tank and the flow rate of the pump. Hydrogen-powered cars are not only eco-friendly and efficient, but also practical and user-friendly. They offer a similar driving experience as conventional cars, but with less hassle and more convenience. Filling up a hydrogen-powered car is just as easy as filling up a propane tank, but much faster than filling up a gasoline car. Also, hydrogen has broad climate adaptivity. Diesel fuel has been a popular choice for vehicles that need to carry heavy loads or tow large trailers as it offers more torque and better fuel economy than gasoline. However, diesel fuel has a drawback. It can gel or solidify in extremely cold regions where the temperatures can drop below zero degree. This can cause problems for the engine, such as clogging the fuel filter, reducing the fuel flow, or damaging the fuel pump. To prevent this, Drivers need to use additives or heaters to keep the diesel fuel from freezing. Unleaded fuel, which is the most common type of gasoline used in vehicles, does not have this problem. Unleaded fuel can withstand temperatures as low as 100 degrees, which is much lower than the freezing point of water. Lithium batteries are more resilient than other types of batteries as they can operate in a wide range of temperatures. Lithium batteries can withstand temperatures as low as negative 140 degree anis before they start to lose their capacity or efficiency. However, lithium batteries are not immune to freezing issues as they can still suffer from reduced performance or damage if they are exposed to extremely low temperatures for a long time. To avoid this, drivers need to keep their lithium batteries warm or insulated when not in use. Hydrogen, on the other hand, and burned in internal combustion engines or converted into electricity and fuel cells. Hydrogen does not freeze or gel like diesel fuel, nor does it lose its capacity or efficiency like lithium batteries. Hydrogen also produces only water vapor as a byproduct, making it a zero emission and eco-friendly fuel. The same principle applies when considering extrema heat. Hydrogen exhibits superior adaptability to a wide range of climates compared to the other two available options. Diesel fuel and unleaded fuel can evaporate or ignite in high temperatures, causing safety hazards or performance issues. Lithium batteries can overheat or catch fire in high temperatures, causing damage or explosion. Hydrogen, however, can withstand temperatures as high as 5,432 degree amadaus which is the surface temperature of the sun. Hydrogen does not evaporate or ignite easily, nor does it overheat or catch fire. Hydrogen can also cool down quickly after being used, making it more efficient and reliable. Therefore, hydrogen is the most suitable choice for extreme cold and hot climates worldwide, as it offers superior adaptability and versatility compared to diesel fuel. Electric vehicles can't give you that experience, but a hydrogen-powered car can because it operates in a similar way. What do you think about this? Let us know in the comments section below.